guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Jasmine and welcome to my channel. I'm going to be starting a new series on my YouTube channel and those are going to be the series of all the basics of figure skating, which means basic one all the way through basic six. So don't worry guys, I think I'm qualified to teach you guys how to do the basics of figure skating because I passed my senior moves and I'm a gold medalist and I have a pin to prove it. That's my qualification. <laughs> but anyways, today I'm going to be going over basic one with you guys. The moves that you need to have master to pass basic one are the sit up, ice, and stand up, march forward across the ice, forward two foot glide, a dip, forward swizzles, six, eight in a row, backward wiggles, six, eight in a row, beginning snow plow stop on two feet or one foot, and if you want to go the extra step to make sure that you 100% pass, there's a bonus skill, which is the two foot hop in place. So I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do all these moves and going over them step by step with you guys. So without further ado, let's get started. To do the first skill of sitting on the ice and standing up, you want to fall to the side or you can just sit on the ice. But if you decide to fall to the side, you don't want to fall on your knees, your back, or your head because you can get seriously hurt from falling on those. So just fall on the side of your leg. Then you want to get on to both of your knees and stand up like you're kneeling. Bring one of your knees to the front. Put one arm on your leg and then the other hand over it and push up to stand up in a standing position and you just mastered the first skill. start off you want to find yourself a line for you to start yourself marching on and you're going to go to one of the boards on either side of the rink and start there. You want to make sure to have your posture straight up and your arms out straight to have your balance. Then you're going to take tiny steps. You might not be able to take as big of steps as me but you will eventually be able to. So you want to bring up your knee as far as you possibly can but don't bring it up more than 90 degrees because then you will probably not be able to keep your balance and you might fall over so the highest to bring up your knee is 90 degrees or a little bit lower then you want to start marching across the ice from one side of the rink to the other side of the rink to do a two foot glide is start off at one of the edges of the rink then you want to take a couple of pushes or take a couple of marching steps and then you want to bring your feet together so that you're just gliding across the ice you want to have your feet together touching so that you can have your balance you want to have your posture straight and you want to keep your arms out straight as well so that you can keep your balance but you might not be able to go as fast as I can, but that's okay because you guys are just starting. But if you keep on working on it, you guys will soon be able to go faster and faster. The 
next skill is a dip. To do a dip, you want to take a couple of pushes, and then you want to bring your feet together and bend down by your knees. So what you want to do is you're going to be gliding in a two-foot glide forward, but you're going to be like sitting in an imaginary chair. But you don't want to bend your knees more than 90 degrees. But if they're a little bit above 90 degrees, that's fine, but not too high. But you also don't want to go too low because that makes it too easy to do. So that's how you do a dip. To do forward swizzles, you want to start at one end of the ring and you're going to start with your heels together like you're in first position of ballet. You're going to push out your legs in a like half circle on each side, not too far because then you might not be able to bring them in together or not too small because then they might not count it as a swizzle. So you have to find like the medium for you. So after you push it out, you're going to bring your toes together like you're doing a reversed first position. So you're like pigeon toeing your toes in and you want to repeat that six to eight times in a row. How to do backward swizzles, you're going to start at one end of the rink with your feet together and then you're going to make little short edges with your skates. So one side you're going to take both of your feet to the right, the other side you're going to take both of them to the left. And when you're on the outside of one edge, the other is on an inside and you want to repeat this six to eight times in a row. To do a snowplow stop, it's pretty easy because it matches its name pretty well because you're pretty much making snow with your blade. So I chose to do a one foot stop instead of two feet because it's easier to learn and to do. What you want to do is start with your legs standing together and push one of your foot out until you're making snow. Then bring it back together and repeat it on the other leg. two foot hop you're gonna start standing on the ice nice and straight with your back up and your arms out to the side and your legs standing parallel to each other then you're gonna bend your knees and jump up as high as you can you don't have to jump up that high you just have to jump up as long as you're getting off of the ice and then when you come down you're gonna land with bent knees not straight knees so it doesn't hurt your knees and you can repeat this as many times as you want or you can just do it once if you'd want this is the end of the video i hope that you guys enjoyed and that it might have helped you guys learn something about basic one and figure skating and it might have helped you pass your basic one moves test I want you guys to comment down below, have you passed your basic one moves test? As I told you guys in the beginning of this video, I passed my senior moves, which means I've passed all of the figure skating moves tests, including basics. Anyways, also don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. I love you guys. Bye!